What's up, buddies? This is the second recording attempt of the intro because I'm an idiot. Uh, welcome back to another episode of the First Owner Road to Glory. Uh, we got, hopefully, a lot to update you guys with. Yesterday's epi was pretty dead in terms of our Team of the Season pack luck. We didn't get anybody. But we sure as hell did get an awesome icon out of our um, like our 50th mid-icon pack. So I, I, am, I am very happy about yesterday's episode today we're back to crafting we're back to grinding we're going to be grinding through a lot of bronze pack methods silver upgrades gold upgrades all of that stuff i really want to get back on that grind um and we also have 98 packs crafted for today's epi we've done a bunch of squad battles we've done a bunch of icon swaps so the premier league icon swap was done i had a blast using that team by the way we brought on alsama and mcguire Thoughts on Alsama, just like Team of the Season Akardi. Alsama's fun to use against relatively garbage FIFA players. Once you get to the high elos or like the really skilled FIFA players that just play the broken meta of 10 players behind the ball, it's just too hard to do stuff with that Alsama. So if you're having fun and you don't care about him not being able to break down or feeling like uh, an, the Eiffel Tower when you're trying to break down like six defenders, go for it and use him. But just know that he's, as you would expect, doesn't really fit that meta or I'm not good enough to make him ball out against the broken meta. Maguire, asinine, dog shit, garbaggio, terrible. Go with a Soyunsu. I mean, if you are going to grind the, the Premier League SBC, for me, that Maguire, either if you're running an English team or you're a weirdo Man United fan, um, would be the only ways to use him. I would go with Soyunsu or any other of the hundred really good center backs um, in the league. And I would just personally use the Maguire, which is what I'm going to do. I'm going to use him as SBC fodder down the road when I need a player to throw into um, a, 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 an icon pack or a guaranteed team of the season pack. So that kind of updates you guys. We're going to claim some rewards today on stream. We're going to work on the league icon swap with the team that you can see. And I'm going to try and finish off. And this is a nice segue into this section here. I'm going to try and finish off uh, Romarinho. I, everybody's telling me this guy's awesome. And we've kind of done these by accident. So we're going to try and just Folk, I'm. This is what I know. I'm gonna hate today's session of FIFA because now I have to focus and try and get goals and assists with specifically Brazilian players, while um, not necessarily trying to get wins. But I'm gonna have to force it with Brazilians, and that always means I'm gonna give up easy chances with players that aren't Brazilian to try and force the ball to Brazilian players, which means I'm gonna lose more games, etc., etc., etc. Nevertheless. We are going to work on trying to unlock this guy. Everybody seems to tell me he's good. I don't know how he could be that good with three star, four star as a skill set, but we're going to try him out. Why not? And then, you know, as Way says, worst case scenario, he does end up being good SBC fodder. So, you know, uh, that's where we're at. We got a two player pack from him there. We've got a gold pack from him there. But again, what do we what have we learned from grinding this year? You can't turn your nose up at any type of pack. Because any type of pack could have something awesome in it. Specifically, these packs also can get icons in them, right? So if your luck is in, maybe you hit something uh, awesome there. Milestones, again, just doing the Premier League SBC. We got another... Um, we're chipping away at these milestones. I don't know if I'm really going to dedicate any time by the end of the game to get all of these players. Maybe I will, but... I I also don't know if I will, man. I don't know if I care. It's kind of fun, like, slowly but surely chipping away at them. Maybe when we get beyond the halfway point with this team, same thing. Maybe when we get beyond the halfway point, beyond that, which which this is not going to happen, but maybe then we start focusing on trying to uh, get these achievements done. But I, I don't know. I think it's a little bit too little too late uh, in those situations. Jimenez, um, again, just, like, chipping away at other things, getting this done. I don't know if this Jimenez will be finished. I've got, what, two days to get him done. Now, again, we've kind of uh, by accident done a couple here. So I don't know. I, I would be a little bit disappointed if I didn't get this Jimenez because he is so overpowered for the sweaty players, like the guys that just sit back with the drop back, counterattack, tap in type of goals. This guy puts everything away and he's super fast and he's super good with like the run. What I've noticed the sweat players use, and maybe you guys use them too. So, you know, if you're in a high division or you finish you know, relatively good in, in weekend league, the running sprint, like the running fake shot with this guy is so broken. He's so impossible to get the ball off of him. It makes me furious. Moving on. Um, again, Iosi Perez kind of just chipping away at slowly, but surely, but got him done. Uh, does he even get into our premier league team? Does he take out, does he take out Berwins? No. However, we might end up using him for a Spanish team. 
for the first owner account. He looks kind of all right. Four star, four star. High, high is a bit yikes. But other than that, I think he's a good card. And he's got low shot power, which is disappointing. So I would love to, again, apologies, but I would love to give him an engine. I think as a wide player, an engine would make him fantastic. You just would have to deal with the fact that his long shots and shot power aren't good. And for a wide attacker, you kind of need that. So I think you need to make the decision whether or not you boost his uh, his pace uh, and then leave the shot power and long shots or you boost like the shooting with like a maestro, let's say, which will boost his passing, will boost his shot power to I think 92 is long shots to only 81, but still that's not bad. And then his agility goes up. You got to make those uh, those decisions there, you know, yourself. So we got him all done and claimed. Uh, we'll be getting to the 6 p.m. content in a second here. I'm hoping we get something good, too. So we got the Conma Ball done. This is a nightmare, man. I hate doing all of this. It's so trash, man. It's so absolutely trash. Um, but anyways, moving on. We got that one done. Manshaft with, what, Legendary. Good luck, Sheesh. Have fun with that. Um, win four Rivals matches. There you go. There's the Prem one. All done as well. So we got that one claimed up. I still don't know whether I want to go with the Walmart Hullet or not. Or do we just get Ricardo Kaká? I still have not decided. Because I think right now we can get Hullet. I believe. Anyways. Um, in terms of the player choices. You guys have all argued different ways and different choices for me to go with. I think this Haji looks really good. I just can't see myself using him. Um, I honestly think this El Yunusi looks really good as well. Depending on chem style. But again... Can't really see myself using him. Whereas I can kind of see at some point in the year this Agudelo, um, me using this card. I'm not going to say that he's going to be amazing because his balance, I believe specifically, is atrocious. But if you do the usual where you give him a sniper or you give him an engine, I think he'll become usable. An engine, 72 balance, and then the rest is, is good. Just the 83 finishing isn't great. Or... A sniper where the balance is still kind of bad at 67 yet then he gets what 99 finishing um uh, or nine or 93 finishing one of the two so again you're gonna have to make a decision for me it's not like i'm gonna run into weekend league with this dude but i don't know i, I hey as a striker to finish chances five star weak foot four star skills he can't be awful right <laughs> anyways we move on um we're gonna go with shark week for sure i'm gonna definitely go with shark week and we're gonna make that our uh, our home badge for this champs as well because how could i not so that's fantastic and then we got ourselves another premium gold player pack okay so we got a 25k gold player pack out of the objectives kind of dead but could be not dead right as we always say so i think we can move on can we look into did we get the guaranteed pack what did we get here please ea can it be the but because if we don't get the, the Premier League guaranteed pack today, it's gonna be a dead day of content other than me spamming packs, right? Number one. But number two, it, it's just gonna leave tomorrow so clogged with content. We've got our red player picks tomorrow, which I'm so excited for. I don't deserve it, but I do hope we get a couple of good Premier League reds out of that, not Dean Henderson, which means I'm gonna get two duplicate red Dean Hendersons. Of course, that's just my luck. Um, I don't deserve any better. But it would just mean tomorrow's going to be stacked with content. So what did we get today? Nothing. Premium Alonzo. There's no expiry on him, right? So we will eventually get this guy. Okay. Premier League upgrade. So that's still the same. Under the Kosh. Premium Gold Players Pack. Okay. Throwback UCL Marquee Matchups. A, that's just going to make certain players expensive. Oh my god, have we gotten both in one day? That's a win! Guaranteed Premier League Team of the Season and guaranteed Saudi League Team of the Season pack, dude. Alright, we're doing both. We're absolutely going to do both. Wow, this is going to be... This is going to be great. Now, realistically... EA would be frauds if they made this more expensive than 83 rated and they would be psychos if they made this higher than 87 rated with a team of the season. I think 87 rated with a team of the season, it's expensive, but considering the players you can get from this pack, it's kind of all right. It's kind of worth the risk, right? It's a lot of coins, but it's worth the risk. This one, 
Nobody cares. No, I'm sorry. I I'm sure there's a lot of Saudi League fans, um, residents, etc., that would be excited to open this pack. But 83 rated would be ridiculous. So don't EA, just don't. Okay? If this is like 88 or 89 rated, man, it's going to be, isn't it? And it's 70 chem! <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Okay, whatever. I, I mean, it's not 87, but... Oh my god. I'm gonna do it anyways. Whatever. Okay. So this one is is fair. I, I'm not upset about that. 88 rated, but not just 88 rated, dude. It's the fact that they made it 70 chemistry, bro. That is so shameless from EA. It's not that it's 88 rated because we can all grind SBCs, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, right? To craft and get this, this done. I, I, look, I've got a million and one players to use here. I don't care. But it's the fact that they're just like, yeah, and 70 chem. So suck your mom, everybody. I better get, do we do a search game for this dudes for the end of the epi? Or do we just open it? What, what? I wonder what my viewer base would want. Ironically, the 20 or 30 search games that we've done for mid-icon packs have resulted in nothing. And then the one that we opened yesterday, we got a sick mid-icon. I wonder if we just open this one. Our luck seems to be in the just open. Okay, that's okay though. We got a lot of grinding to do. This will be the end of the episode uh, pack. No problem there. Uh, I don't even think I have a lot of 83 rateds uh, to use. Let's see, though. It, wait, is this 70 chem too? Did I see that correctly? 70 chem as well! Oh, I mean, I guess, you know, whatever. They gotta make it have a cost at some point, right? So left mids, right mids, center backs, their 83 are gonna be through the roof right now. For sure. Even though not many people care too much, they're going to be through the roof. You see all these like untradeable players I have, guys? We'll get the Prem one done ASAP. It's all good. It is all good. The second we get like a high rated untradeable from today's pack spam, we'll then go into. I guess we got to get rid of Ajay or Swift. Who would you guys get rid of first for the Prem? Who would you throw in first? I think this guy looks actually semi all right to use. I think Swift is going to have to go, right? Okay. So we'll probably get rid of Swift. I was going to make a joke, and I'm so glad I didn't. Honestly, dude, I, like, stopped myself mid -set, mid mid it going through my brain. Summer. Oh, we got lots of 84s. Do I toss the 84s in here, too, just in case? Kind of need the Barca players, though. No, no, no. We got lots of 83s. We're fine. We're fine. It's It'd be unnecessary. Unnecessary use of the players. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. Um, do we keep Rodrigo for the UCL? Oh, no. Guys, considering, I should be fine, right? I should be all right here. Yeah, yeah. And then we got we can use 282s as well. Let us not forget that. I wonder if I can use that 80, this guy, Palmer, instead. Um, Sergi, I need... I mean, Rugani isn't really that much. The 82s we can just buy, right? Whatever the hell I need, I can just go buy. Let's try and get the chem here. Do this. 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 Um. This. This. That actually gives us a little bit more chem. There we go. Okay. Um, 
Okay, so there's so I, I and then we could just throw in 82 rated players. So maybe we do this. Put him down here. There we go. And again, maybe not the UCL though specifically. Yeah, we got all the chem in the world. So let's just throw whatever 82 in here and we'll be fine. Perfect. All right, that was quick. Get rid of a bunch of uh, the untradeables. There's no Premier League players in there, right? Because we would have put them into the Premier League upgrade packs for today. So that's also fine. High rating because they know we're saving high fodder for the SBC. Yep. Yep, I agree. I agree. It's okay, though. Look, we're prepared for this. If you grind a poor man Road to Glory style grind at the very least, you're ready for this, right? Surely. Okay. There is the uh, Saudi League team of the season. For sure going to get that 83 rated silver or bronze. These will do on stream. The throwback. The under under the kosh because it is a premium pack. Um, yeah, the throwback. Okay, and I mean, I can't imagine we'd get anything else, right? That's a pretty healthy amount of, of players. Team of the week upgrade. To be fair, the team of the week upgrade wasn't actually all that bad. So if I do get stuck with 83s as duplicates, we can throw them in there. Okay. Love it. Let's clear out the trade ball. We've been good boys and doing bronze pack method and selling off uh, Saudi League, Championship, and Prem Silvers and stuff like that. So we've been kind of clearing things out. Just trying to build, uh, build up the coin balance back again. Whether it's building up our coin balance for uh, the whatever dude, Weekend League squad, or whatever the heck the case may be. Let's see if there's anything that hasn't sold here. Just get rid of all that. And um, let's do that. Not as expensive as, as I was hoping. That. Wow, he didn't even sell for 150 coins. Yikes. Okay. Jeez. Saudi League is nowhere near as much as I was uh, I was thinking it was going to be. That's on me. Bad call. Should have sold them the day they came out. And then, yeah, these two we can just get rid of as well. All right, bros. Let's get into it, man. 106 packs to rip through. Wow, with the strawberry too, huh, babe? Thank you, love. Appreciate you. My good luck charm. Ooh. Oh. Nom, nom. Relax, everybody. Okay, so <clears throat> we've been, as I mentioned, good boys. So we've done silver upgrade packs. We've done gold two-player upgrade packs uh, uh, and, and all of that stuff. So there's still a quite a, not quite a few, but there's still a few Saudi League players you can get from these. And I believe there's a few Prems, right? Henderson is a non-rare, is he not? Who else can we get? Like, what players can we get from these gold upgrade packs? A few people have tweeted me their pack luck. Or is Henderson a rare? Henderson might actually be a rare, you know. I got Rashford is that good. You got one of the best players is that good. Yeah, that's pretty bad, dude. I would just delete your account. <sighs> hey, Nick, I got Youngmin Son. Is that good, though, even, even? Nah, man, that's trash. Unlucky, dude. Richarlison from the Garen. Dude, Richarlison is a cool one, too. I, li I, like, I like the Richarlison pull. That's nice. I wonder, like, would someone like Nep be happy with a Richarlison pull? Because he has the Shapeshifter, and I think the Shapeshifter is even better, right? Because he has that weak foot. Doesn't he? Does the Shapeshifter have the weak foot? I think so, right? So I don't think you could be all that happy if you did hit him. This one also has a five-star weak foot. Wait, so what's the advantage to the shapeshifter again? 
Why did it make that card so cool? Was he, is he five star five star on his uh, shapeshifter? Is that what it is? Went from a right mid to a cam, but so did the team of the season. So really, there's no difference. Just position. Okay. All right. Like, I feel... So what I was getting at there is, like, I kind of feel like someone along... Huh? Okay. For a second, I was like, this guy is 4K? All his cards are 5-star, 4-star. Bro, that Richarlison is sick, man. He is actually sick. Adama is an L? Hell no, dude. Run down the wing and score tappins. The Ramadan kit is sick. Is there a Ramadan kit? How did I miss that? That's awesome if there is. That's a W. Is it from object? It's from objectives? I must have missed it. Dude, what is up with me? I miss like basic things. Is Vardy good? I think Vardy's a cool pull. I, I I also think he got an upgrade on weak foot and skill, or maybe work rates. One of the three things. Score ten, assist eight, and play five. That's kind of cool. Mm. To me, Trent is a big W. I'd be really happy with Trent. I'd be really happy with Robertson. He would get into the uh, back into sorry, uh, our. Premier League setup. I mean, could easily fit him, of course, into the uh, weekend league, whatever, dude, dream team, whatever you want to call it. But I got to keep that for Alfonso Davies. That, that's his spot. I, I can't take Alfonso Davies out of our dream team. So Robertson would just have to play for our Premier League first owner setup, and, and that's it. Fonzi stays in the, uh, in, the, in, the, in the God squad. KDB is all anyone wants? I mean, KDB would be amazing, of course. Bro, imagine KDB. No more Rude Hullet needed, boys. You get KDB, no more Rude Hullet needed. That would be so cool. Uh, What about Mares? I mean, Mares would be awesome. I love Riyad Mares, man. I have the uh, Shapeshifter Mares. Is he untradeable or is he... Tra I think he's untradeable too, which is a bit sad. But um, he's so good. He is so damn good. Now, I don't know. Could his team of the season be broken or not be good or whatever? Maybe it depends on where you use him. But for me, using Mares in that messy position, like wide right, he's great. Really fun. Not strong. He's weak. So you got to kind of stay away from defenders. But I, I like Mares a lot. I want that Giovinco. My friend got KDB out of the first Premier League upgrade pack. Big GG's, man. Big GG's. I got KDB, but it's not Calvin Phillips. Something I would say. Even though it's not possible. Dude, you know what? I already have an untradeable Soyuncu. For sure I'm getting a Soyuncu, right dudes? For sure, I'm getting a Soyuncu. too. Here we go, though. Look at this. Let's go. Get into these. Let's dip dip our toes into these 82 plus packs, BB. Okay. All right. Pepezito. What do you think is smarter? Premier League team of season SBC or mid icon upgrade? I think the Premier League team of the season is just going to be a bit more fun, isn't it? I would go Prem. I would go. I mean, why not both? If you grind the league SBCs, Sud America, Libertadores, etc., you should easily be able to do both. Um, if not, do them. If you grind properly, you should be able to do the mid icon SBC once every three or four days. No problem. That's kind of the tempo that we're on right now. <clears throat> Mid icon is there for 30 plus days. Yep. Yep, yep. 
CR7 is now 400k. Not surprised. Oh, wa watch the uh, Prime Icon moment Johan Cruyff be like 7 mil soon. I will happily say this right now. And sometimes I wish YouTube could be part of the happiness we get on stream. Let's fucking go, boys. We needed that. We needed that. Um, let me get my point across before I completely forget what I was talking about. Just like a few years ago when I was using Moments Dino and last year, last year, when I was using Moments Johan Cruyff, the only reason I'm addicted to and still having fun with this game for FIFA 20 Ultimate Team right now is thanks to Icon Moments Johan Cruyff. And I hate to admit that because as we said yesterday and as we've talked about very regularly on this channel, EA control this game to the point where it is so pay to win. It is so much more fun to use the big dog of someone you like, i.e. for me, an Icon Moments Cruyff, or for you, a, a team of the season Richarlison instead of his regular card. Like they just have it figured out this year, man. Um, the game is so pay to win. And uh, it's unfortunate, but I got to admit, I'm, I'm really happy that at least for our weekend league setup, we're doing the whatever dude. Just as a, like, a little spicy thing on the side, because it's the only reason I'm having fun. It honestly is. This game is so terrible that you almost need the big dog good players to, like, help you carry through the button delay and the terribleness. And I swear to God, I'm starting to think, like, EA do it on purpose now. And sure, that's big time, you know, tinfoil hat wearing 28T, but I, I, I just can't shake that from my brain. That they've got... Ooh. It's a board? Nice. From a one rare two player pack. Yeah, I just, I, it, part of me feels like maybe they have it coded like that. Uh, we bought Cry for just under uh, 9 mil. I don't know. I don't even want to know what his price is. I don't care. He's staying in the club forever. It's the most pay-to-win game on the market by far. Oh no, Ultimate Team is the most has been the most pay-to-win game and franchise for the last 11 years, for over a decade. That's facts. But this year, they've got it on another level entirely, man. Another level entirely. Will I tweet when I'm going to open the pack? Uh, maybe. Maybe. Maybe we'll pop the tweet. Potentially. Is Madden also pay to win? Yeah. I don't know if it's as pay to win, but it is pay to win, right, dudes? You'd have to ask skills. I think skills plays the living hell out of Madden. That was a waste of an 88 rated team. Yeah. All right, we got Rabio back. Small, rare gold player pack. Come on, man. Throw me an icon moments out of this. You know you want to, EA. Come, come. Damn it. The Akimbo on Warzone is so overpowered, it's insane. Not only is it overpowered, but then you mix it with those nerd snake shooting as well. And it's the dumbest combo I've ever had the misfortune of experiencing. <clears throat> if you run Akimbo's and snake shot, you're the same type of player that runs one depth drop back and spams sweats across the goal. Because you know it's broken and it's an easy way to win. It's gross. 88 rated players are like 50k right now. GG. Hey, GG. We'll be cashing out if we pack any. That'll help us make some uh, some cash monies back. Gold pack method. Player prices uh, shooting up like that, dudes. Gold pack method might be the move. Just 5k packs. Come on, baby. Man, these are not paying out for me. They are not. Is Hendo a dub? For me, I, I don't even know. I don't think it would be a dub, personally. Is Cryf better than Neymar? Yeah. Yes, I mean, absolutely. Neymar still lights out. And, I, and Neymar's still on my team. Neymar's my wide cam, and Johan Cruyff is the central cam. Um, I, I'm sure I would benefit with Cruyff being the striker and Neymar being the central cam. But I can't. I just can't bring myself to take Cristiano out of the team, dude. He's so good. Wait, are these? Oh, it's untradeable. Hernan, what's up, Habibi? Let's throw you in the team, man. 
Why not? The team of the season pack has ruined my day. Oh no. Just grind the suit in Lib America, uh, Libertadores or whatever, dude. Grind the CSL. You'll get all your 88 rated players back and make money. Just gotta put a little bit of time into it, Habibi. Uh, cash money or nah? Nah. Not cash money. Team of the season has made my day. Hype for rewards now. Okay. I love the, I love the, like, the difference in thought process. Some people love it. Some people hate it. Obviously depends on the luck. For me, I'm expecting a Henderson a so or a Soyonsu. I I'm prepared for the absolute worst. I don't know about you guys, but that's, uh, that's what I'm waiting for. And if we get anything else, I'll be pleasantly surprised. The problem with the Soyonsu for me specifically as well is like, I already have him untradeable. So that's the, that's where the yikes comes in. I mean, a VVD, okay, you guys will love that, right? As a troll. A VVD wouldn't be the end of the world because it would make another mid icon pack. I would have to use like 83 rated players. So, uh, yeah, it wouldn't be the complete end of the world. Oh, the 83s are up in price by a little as well. Not much, but. Isn't there three choices of players and you get two tries and impossible to get those players? Impossible to get Henderson. I don't know if you've opened Weekend League packs, but EA predominantly weight the packs with terrible players. You will pack duplicates of horrendous players. You go watch top 100 pack openings for red player picks, my dude. You'll see like five red player picks of the worst players over and over and over again. It's just it's the way they have the game coded. Unfortunately for all of us. Nice jumper. Thanks, man. Clothing line is kind of on hold right now um, for the pandemic. But once it comes back, we're going to come up with some really, really cool, cool designs. Some classy, like urban, urban streetwear type of stuff. I'm really excited for it. I got Salah in mind. Got Jordan Henderson. Not too bad. Yeah. I guess I'd throw Henderson. Okay, so. I don't want to delete 3,000 coin Prem players. So when we get duplicates that are Premier League, I'm going to at least try to quickly throw together a... Where, where, where the hell is it? This one. I'm going to try and throw together a team real quick, if possible. Right? Would that, would that be better to do, guys? Or just straight discard and move on? feel like this would be a good play i'm gonna use 84 delhi as well 84 and below get thrown in here oh you know what there i might only have two players <laughs> um okay yikes yeah we're oh how the hell do i get a duplicate berwin when that's one of three rares i have in the premier league the luck. The lack of luck. Oh my goodness. That's awful. Seriously, I only have three. And we just packed them, but basically twice in a row. Alright, well, you know what? I said I was going to do this if I had, like... If I was short two or three players, I'd go buy them. I'm not going to go buy ten players or seven players or whatever it is. It's such a... Such a waste. I got 99 VVD. GG. Enjoy. He's incredible. 82 rated squad instead. Yeah. Yeah, I could have done that, I guess. I could have done that. It's actually not a bad look. Come on, baby. Give me a blue. No, dude. So hard? It's so hard to get blues. 84 and DD. All right, well, there's another Prem player. Yay. Got Rashford, but already have Team of the Year Mane. Well, I mean, I... how can you be upset about that, dude? That breaks my brain. Okay, we got another Prem player. 
Just put him somewhere else. On seven chem, will be fine. You could have got another money. I got the third best Saudi team of the season. Good for fodder. Yeah. Yeah, like, even for me, I, I don't know what I'm going to... It doesn't matter what I get from the Saudi players. They're probably going to be fodder. Surely. Unless it's Giovinco. If it's Giovinco, I kind of want to use... If it's Hamdullah, I kind of want to try him out. We'll use him maybe... Oh my god, I'm so irritated. Another... Oh, how? I have such a limited club right now. How am I constantly getting these weird dupes? Um, okay, let's go see. If we haven't done Barca, I'm just going to spend the money on getting Barca finished off. No, I don't think I do have it done. Sasuna isn't done. There it is. Perfect. All right, whatever. We'll do that. Real quick. Go over here. Go to Barcelona. And that. That. How many do I need? Five. Okay, so we need two more. So we'll go with the incredibly overpriced striker. Maybe they've come down in price since then. Gold. What the actual hell? They're, they're more expensive now? Eh? Okay? Uh, They're like a, even a 71 rated. Whatever, dude. I actually think the 67 rated will be fine. I've got so many players to use. We all right. Okay. You know what? I don't think I have a lot of La Liga players either. Oh, yikes, man. I didn't think this through at all. Um, okay, let's do that. Absolute overkill with what I'm using right now, but that's fine. Um... I'm try not use rares. Maybe we save rares for the uh, 82 pluses. Need one more CB. Or not. We need one more CB. And 79 works or is it 80 rated? Damn it. Okay, that's fine. Are done? Yeah, yeah. Okay, another mega pack. Why not? Don't mind if I do. Uh, 82 pluses. Will I be opening viewer prem upgrades later? I don't know, man. Maybe. We could do. If you guys... I know... I don't know, I just feel like every content creator does that. I mean, I understand why they do it. I totally get it, but meh. Oh, walkout, finally. That's our first walkout from about 70, 82 plus... Oh, it's dead. <laughs> from about 70, 82 plus packs. I'll take it. Mid-icon or uh, Prem Team of the Season. Yeah, SBC fodder all day. Got Hamdullah and Jordan Henderson? That's not bad. That is not bad at all. Can you open my bronze pack? <laughs> Just got rid of that guy. He was already untradeable, so. Mini win. Come, come. Damn it. How's mid Dizay at center back? Pretty good. I liked him. I liked him enough not to get rid of him. Cool. Sweatiest player alive. 
Let's just open this 25k pack and these mega packs. If the luck is in, the luck is in. We don't need to save it till the end. We're saving the guaranteed team of the season till the end anyways. Okay. Is Salah a win with a three-star weak foot? I think either way, Salah's a win, man. Honestly. I think you got yourself a bit of a dub there. Team of the season pack will be for the end of the epi, dudes. Always. Always. We got a hell of a lot of packs to grind through here. Boards. Oh, yikes. A lot of players, though. I don't mind that at all. Very good. So that was from Barca? Do these have values? A little bit. Might as well take the money. The fact that CR7 is now under um, 400k is insane to me. What a player for 400k. And I'm, I'm assuming you can also get him fresh too, right? Some guy just thrashed me with Team of the Season Richarlison. Yeah, that card is so meta. It's so good. Boards, no walkouts, though. Ian, thank you for the 27. He's 470k. Wait, so is he under 400k on Xbox, then? Dude, I mean, to me, anything under a million for Cristiano is an amazing deal. I think he's so damn good. How much, out of curiosity, someone like Cristiano that was like 9 million before Team of the Season started off. Where, where's the Team of the Year Cristiano at now? I think people are just preparing for his Team of the Season to come out, so I'm sure that card's probably plummeted in price. Wow. Apparently these are expensive. CR7 is 295k on Xbox. <laughs> Dude! Wow! What? Look, if you want to have some fun and enjoy the meta while also using one of the greatest players of all time, buy that card. What a price, dude. That is incredible. Wow, man. What chem style for Kovacic? I loved using him with an engine. Kovacic was so, so good. Really, way better than Fred. The only reason Fred is still in the team is because he's untradeable. I'd rather use the funds uh, to just open more upgrade packs or save up for the whatever dude next uh, next pickup. Tier 7 better than Mbappe at striker? For me, base to base, yes. He is. Cristiano Ronaldo does not play like a 6'2 player. Cristiano Ronaldo plays like Mbappe does for his height but then has the physicality as well. You missed my sub? I've missed everybody's subs. The subs are turned off, man. Alerts have gotten way too nuts. So I've kind of just turned them off for the uh, for the episode recordings for now. CR7, 6.9 mil. Wow, so he's dropped two mil. It's actually not as much as I thought. Worth playing CR7 on 8 chem? Dude, you can play Ronaldo on 4 chem. He'll be OP. It's best to play him on 10 because then you can max out an engine for his balance. Um, He's lights out good on 10 chem with an engine. So, so spicy. Alright, let's get these trash ones open. Got uh, Juan Bissaka. I thought it was Trent. Juan Bissaka is still a win, though, no? You guys don't think a Juan Bissaka is a W? Cristiano's now dropping like a stone on PS. Good buy time, then, I would assume. Is it just me or is the sound not in sync? Uh, I'd feel like it's probably just you, bro. Got Vardy, is that a W? I mean, I think I would test out Vardy, but I still think that Trezeguet is better. 
Juan Basaka is dog shit. That's not a good pull. Juan Basaka is dog shit. What? Bro, regular Juan Basaka was like meta at the start of the year. Interesting. I would have thought that'd be a great card. Icon striker under a mill. Any suggestions? Uh, what's what's like a prime Crespo looking like right now? Can you can you get yourself like a moment's rush for that price yet? Or can you get a version of Kenny Dalglish yet at that price? Anything along those lines would be pretty hype. So you can get a moment's rush. That's sweet. I like that. Moments Crespo is 850? What? Moments Crespo is under a mil. Okay, never mind. Moments Crespo is your pull is your is your pickup. Moments Crespo is your pickup. Moments are crashing so hard. I love it. Guaranteed we've lost our shirt on uh Johan. Yeah, I also thought Crespo would at least be two mil, based off of how nuts his moments card was. This is good, though. This is the time of the year where everything crashes. As we've said as well, I love that where a couple of weeks ago we were saying exactly what would happen. And so was every other trader. But, and people are like, nah, man, no way these come down, man. It doesn't matter how good the team of the seasons are. People are still going to want this moment or that moment or whatever. It's like, nah, man. When you can get a, a team of the season Robertson for 250K or Cristiano Ronaldo for 300K, what makes you think that um, a moment's Crespo or even a moment's, you know, wing back of some sort is going to hold value. They're just not. They're absolutely not. I got team of the season Trent. Well, happy. Yeah, I'd be pretty happy about a Trent. We'd use him for this weekend league at least. Maybe maybe save me picking up a moment, Zambrata. I don't know. What's uh, Trent's weak foot? Is it four star? Because I, I really like Trippier, and I think it's because of his stats, obviously, but his four star weak foot, too, makes him really, really handy. Trent's got a four star, too? Yeah, he's, Trent's got to be really good in game, man. As an attacking minded wing back, he's got to be amazing. Duplicate untradeable Kovacic, so I put him into an icon pack? I would say yes. I would say yes. I probably would. Afraid to open the pack? I'll be disappointed. Dude, I'd just rip it, man. Who cares? Either way, who cares, man? You know? If you're disappointed, you get to go play Warzone. How many times have I packed that guy? Mares is a W. The only tough one for me is like I've got so many right mids. Just for constantly forcing players off of chem. If you don't pack an English team of the season, I'll gift 80,000 subs. Hey. Okay. Looks like Elon Musk just put a bet um, on in the chat. I want Red Mares and Red Richarlison. Wait, what the hell? Did that have a gold? What was that? Oh! Okay. Well, there's a Paderborn player. Jesus, that's like a 15k player. And that is exactly why you do your homework, boys. You do the bronze packs. You do the silver upgrade packs. Okay? Don't be lazy. Be crazy, dudes. Oh, they're all gold. All right. Yeah, the strikers, center backs, and DMs are back to being insane prices. Messi's down to 400k on PS as well. Yeah, I mean, if Cristiano Ronaldo's price is tanked, then that doesn't surprise me at all.
He's only 10k, Nick. Oh, damn. My bad, dude. Apologies, brother. I'm so sorry, my dude. Past and present Barcelona teams are going to be mental. Why is Busquets 60k but Griezmann's 40k on Xbox? Makes no sense. Is Griezmann 89 as well? Maybe just for links? I don't know. Maybe because people haven't caught on to Griezmann and Griezmann will be 60k soon? If they're both 89, then I would say that Griezmann's probably a good investment, realistically. If you can even call it that. Neymar's now the most expensive gold in the game. Doesn't surprise me with a 5-star, five 5-star five -star and easy links. I got Allison. I mean, as, as disappointing as some... As disappointed as some people would be with an Allison, I'd actually pretty be... Okay. I wouldn't be hyped about it, but I wouldn't be upset because he would go right into the Dream Team and he'd go right into our Premier League team. First owner Premier League team and into our Dream Team. So... Yeah, I wouldn't be too upset about it. Allison isn't good. No goalkeepers are good, my friend. For me, it's just a card collection and what looks good on the screen. No goalkeepers are good. Unless you're using a base Ter Stegen or a base Oblak. Um, mine should be tradable. And it's not even worth listing. Goalkeeping is based on luck. Yeah, or like who has the um the like advantage, if you will. Finish the Lib and Sud, submit now or wait till team of the season. No no no. Lib and Sud, you just constantly rinse and repeat. Submit it until you have all six of the players, then you put those six players into whatever the hell SBC you want. Right now the Premier League setup or a mid icon squad or whatever it is. DJ, thank you, man. Jolie, thank you. Appreciate you. Got Adama, massive L. Is that a massive L? Wait, is that a board? Wait, what the hell was that? Is that a walkout? Did I just skip a team of the season? Bro. What the hell? That had boards and it looked like it was a walkout. Like, it looked like it was an aqua color as a walkout. What the fuck was that? That was the... I, that's the most baited I've been all week. Holy jeez. That's embarrassing, man. <laughs> that is actually really embarrassing. Yikes. I saw the boards. The door opened and it was super slow and zoomed out. And it was like an aqua or whatever the hell the color is. Which, I mean, means it probably actually guaranteed would have only been a Saudi League team this season, but not even that, man. Every time, yeah, so it's, again, 74 rated is boards. Six, just like 64 rated bronze rares are boards too. We just got, we got cheesed. No, I'm, Sharpie, I'm well aware of why it's a board. But again, you can get team of the seasons from these. So, I just thought we were hitting team of the season, that's all. Seventy-four rated silvers just get a totally different animation. Okay, so that is more specifically where the troll is coming from. Hold Aubameyang? GG. Wonder how that Aubameyang would play. Surely he's got to play really well. I think the PL's highest rating will be, other leagues will be 86, 87. I would be, I okay, I wouldn't be surprised if La Liga, Serie A, and the Bundesliga were 88. I wouldn't be surprised. Should they be 88? No. I think the Bundesliga should be 86. And I think, like, La Liga and the Serie A should be 87, purely because of, like, Cristiano and Messi in there.
Imagine the ultimate one. Ultimate one will be like 90 rated. Yep. And again, it's a litmus test for them, right? They're seeing where they can max out the ratings and us as a stupid community will do it. And then next year, it'll probably be even worse. Next year for FIFA 21, man, on new consoles and stuff like that, once team of the season comes around, it is probably going to cost, you know, 90. A 90 rated team with two team of the seasons for the Prem. And then they'll just keep going until they get a big enough backlash. We're like, oh, and then they'll go back like a little bit. Oh, we'll, we'll go back to an 89 and everybody will freaking, you know, suck them off for how, for how nice they're being. I think this guy's cash. He's not cash. Can confirm he's not cash. I would love to see an Ansu Fati type of card. Even if it's like a moments card to like some obscure moment where he scores his first goal for the team or something like that. I'd love to see a ball in 90 rated Ansu Fati. I'd have to figure out a way to fit him into a team. I would get him. Oh, that's actually a very good pull. Like that. Are you going to finish opening all the 50 packs and you'll open the team this season? Well, yes and no. I'll just kind of be doing whatever I want to do. I haven't really decided the route. I don't have like a map of exactly what we'll do. That's most likely what we're going to do. Surely he would get one white, right? Who Who is that we're talking about specifically? Who do I want most? Who do I want most? Um, It's crazy. From the Prem, I don't really want anybody. Honestly, it's not Calvin Phillips. It's not Alfonso Davies. It's not another Canadian or Leeds player. So I don't really care. But in terms of like just the hype and the meta, I would love to get a team of the season young men's song. I think he would be, considering how much I loved his regular card on the uh, Poor Man Road to Glory through the start of the year and onwards, I, I would love a young man. I again, I don't know how the hell I would fit him in a team. He would walk into our first owner Premier League team, but into our dream team, I don't, I don't know how I would fit him. Should have been a team of the season. Am I right, dudes? absolutely deserved bro he would have been so good too it'd have been like 92 sprint speed like 88 acceleration been like 85 composure oh he would have actually been a good card six foot one is a bit yikes though in terms of usability on the field but who even is that can we go ahead and ban that guy thank you All right, well, another lib player, but nothing great. Okay, five more silver packs, boys. Not even, four more silver packs. Forget about J-Lings, it's all A-Lings now. I'll take that, that's good. I need that for uh, Osasuna. That's nice. Hoping for an attacker tomorrow. Yeah. At this point, I'm hoping for anything other than Dean Henderson. Non-duplicates would be cool, really. At this point, it's like, I, I'm hoping for non-dupes. That's a good pull. That's a good pull. I mean, those are good pulls, but it's going to be a while before we grind the uh, the championship again to get Ben White as like uh, a duplicate SBC fodder. That We're a while away from that, but... All right. Wait. What the hell is the team of the season pack? Four gold rare PL player pack. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Roger that, roger that, roger that. We're chilling. Now it's all good packs, dudes. Now it's all good packs. Let's go. Come on. One team of the season out of these packs, then Giovinco, and then Hyung Min Son. That's going to be the, the trajectory here, dudes. I hope so.
Finally got Ben White. I hope you're not lying about his insaneness. Why would I lie? I mean, you you, you watched us go 14 and 1 with him. And then 17 and 4. He's incredible. Dean Henderson, that 83, and then Dean Henderson again. Yep. That's the reality. It really is. Come on, blue! No, you twat. Maguire's so dead. Not only is he so dead, he's such a trash card too. Not even a high enough rating. But I think that, I think we're limited to, to 90 rated players for the uh, League SBCs. You know what I will say? I'm grateful enough that we got Team of the Seasons in the League SBCs. That's nice. It's good enough for me. Search game. I think we're going to open the pack just as is, bros. I think we're going to open it as is. I kind of want to just open it. If we do a mid-icon pack tomorrow... I, no, we got red player picks tomorrow, so we won't be doing a mid-icon pack tomorrow. But, like, over the weekend, if we do a mid-icon pack or whatever it is... Come on, blue! No, dude. Ew. It's just... These, these packs suck for me, man. They're really trash. Yay. Serie A, Serie A. Bundes... La Liga, La Liga, 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 four gold common players. Wait, what? I still have four common players? That's dead. And DePaul? This guy's inform is so trash. Such a bad card. Feel a like KDB coming for you, Nick? Low key. You, we're gonna have to spend hours restructuring the team i'm telling you that right now okay dudes you guys gotta help me restructure if we get something of that level we're gonna have to restructure the the dream team we need to figure out a way to fit um alfonso davies there's no way basically there's gonna be no way there's gonna be like players on four cam in our dream team if i get a debrina because how am i gonna fit alfonso, alfonso davies ben white Ronaldo. Well, Ronaldo can go, but Messi, Neymar, um, Calvin Phillips. It's just too much. <laughs> there's, there's too many things. You won't. Yeah, I don't. I don't think. I don't think I will. I do not think I'll be able to. <laughs> you need like ten leagues. I know. This is why I hate EA's chemistry system. I find it so stupid. Like, let me use Alfonso Davies. However and wherever I want. Let me use Ben White and Calvin Phillips. However and wherever I want. Let me use Kimmich or Vidal or Jonathan David. Or, like, at least let me use them and then build up their chemistry to where they should be strong linking. After 100 games or 200 games or whatever the hell it is. Like, let me do that. Well, what's the, what's the harm in that? Is regular gold Messi OP? He's not OP, especially not anymore. He he was very fun to use and very good at the start of the game. I was stomping people with regular Messi for the first month or two on the rich man account. Um, but he's not OP. He's definitely not OP. He's just fun and rewarding to use. That's all. Something special about scoring um, a nice goal with Lionel Messi. Feels so much better than doing it with a Ryan Kent or, uh, you know an Orsic or an Adama Traore for me. But maybe that's because I'm an elitist prick. I don't know. Like, I I really enjoy scoring a goal with Johan Cruyff, and I don't get that same enjoyment out of doing it with Ben Yedder. Why? I don't know. I, I don't know the explanation, and I almost don't want to find out, because it's probably not a good reason. Probably something to do with elitism or a superiority complex or something super super not good and that's why though ea have this game on lockdown man because i, I feel like at least for me and a lot of people like me you want to use your favorite players or the best players or you know the best versions of your favorite players because it's more fun and more enjoyable and and they've just got it
you, the Man United fans, freaking out right now that I got a Jones. The Many-Faced God. I think that's the only applicable name for Jones. Good job, Troke. That's awesome, man. Great to hear. You enjoy more if you score with your favorite players? Yeah. I just, like, I don't get any enjoyment out of scoring from... Let me think of, like, super sweaty attackers, even, like, at the start of the year. Um, like, to some extent for me, like, I got no enjoyment scoring, like, with, with Rashford or base Ben Yedder and shit like that at the start of the year. Just or Lucas Moura, you know, those types of players. I just don't care. I did, never cared. Never cared. Or, like, having through the back line, like, just Varane and Militao, like, eh. Eh. I, I just, I, you know, it's kind of why we would even like at the start of the year run with Marcelo instead of like just a Jordi Alba or like whatever the absolute most OP setup is at the time. You know, Ferlin Mendy or whatever the fuck it is. But that's just, like, that's just my thought process. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not saying everybody has to agree with it or everybody has to do that. I'm just saying that for me, that's where my enjoyment levels are, which is why it kind of sucks. Because it involves pay to win to get to where I want to be. Whether it's with your bank account or your time. I got Trent super happy. Bro, I'd be really happy about Trent. We're, we're getting there, boys. We're getting there. Got a couple of big boy packs to open. And then, uh, and then it's the Saudi League team of the season. And then... And then... The Prem team of the season. Should be pretty easy to put together, too. I've got the idea. So how many? Yeah, okay. Woo-hoo-hoo! -hoo! Let's go, boys! Dude, where's my car's classic? It is. It really is. Can confirm. My neck is still destroyed. All the things I've done have not helped it. The only thing that helps is Advil, which is not something I want to be taking regularly. Am I doing the team of the season search? I don't think so, man. I think we'll save that for the icon packs. <clears throat> Will I open silver one rewards? No. I think it's going to be gold two rewards and up. I mean, does it... Or, sorry, gold three rewards and up, let's say. Because you could still get... It'd be interesting to see... It'd be interesting to see what... How gold three does versus, like, people that push on to gold two and above. Right? Because you can still get prem from it. It's just random. Whereas gold two and above, it's guaranteed. You get a prem. You're guaranteed a Dean Henderson, whereas in gold three you just most likely will get a Dean Henderson. Oh, CN, I have no idea who'd be your striker in that setup, man. I don't know if I'd use any of those guys as, your, as a striker. I think Nep would use a KDB at striker as opposed to Messi or even a Sala. Time to go around the sub grind again. Did the 688 rate players for the Prem upgrade? Yeah, I'll probably be doing that today too. And we'll go do and do, we'll do at least two of the sub and two of the lib tonight. Nep and KDB are a lovely couple though. Yeah, Nep always seems to have the best version of KDB pack pulled every year. Thirty k away from being able to do the Prem pack. Looks like you need to get on the grind, Habibi. Okay, two more of these Garbo packs, but good way to fill the club up. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my goodness. Don't care. Wow. Got to work on getting rid of the uh, untradables first. That's got to be a priority when I do these 82 plus packs or any like any level of grind. I got to get rid of untradables first. 
Because at least if I get a duplicate and I swap them in for a tradable player, we can always make a little bit of cash back. Gomis and Richarlison, a W in my books. Absolutely a W triple. 100%. If rewards are bad tomorrow, I don't know what to do anymore. I mean, either play or don't play, right? That's really that's really where it's at, man. I, look, even if you get the worst rewards, just know that even using the best of the players like Johan Cruyff, etc., it's still a piss take, man. I'm actually going to open the Saudi pack first, okay? Let's get it. And then we'll do the Prem packs in the build-up to the Prem Guaranteed Team of the Season pack. Come on, baby! Giovinco! Watch it not be a walkout, even. It's a walkout! Good start! Oh. Left mid? Who's this? I don't even know who this is. Is this even good, even? Could use him for the Brazilian objective today. So, small victory. I don't know what his weak foot and skills are. But I'll, I'll count that as a small victory. Maybe we can use him as a... Is he left-footed or right-footed? Because I've got Neymar. Birth, Fun birthday, Douglas Costa. Uh, Red Felipe Coutinho is our central cam. I need a left-footed attacker. Baby W. Let's find out. Let's find out, boys. Let's see where, when, and how. Right-footed, four-star, weak foot. E. That's a that's the smallest of W's you're ever gonna get. We're gonna use oh god, 60 balance two for a wide player? Hey bro, thank you for the raid, dude. Alerts are turned off right now for the Epi recording, but thank you, brother. Some hearts in the chat for uh for Hey Baby Baby. Yeah, that's a yikes. That's a garbage card, isn't it? Well, I might just throw him into the Prem setup, man. I don't know. We'll see. We shall see. All right. Four Prem player packs. I mean, we did 14 yesterday and didn't get anything. So surely we won't get anything out of these four. That's not even a board, is it? It's a 30,000 coin pack right there. Yikes. And that's another discard, isn't it? Whatever. Don't care. Second one. Come on, baby. Come on, dude. Guaranteed team of the season packs don't count for the for the for the giveaway pool, dudes. They're guaranteed. Got to get them from a pack. That should be pretty obvious. Come on, baby. I'll throw a hundred dollars on if the prem team of the season is a good one. How about that? If the Prem team of the season is a good one, I'll happily throw $100 on. Okay. We'll take it up to $800. Well, these gold player packs have been as awful as always. Final one. Yeah, it's not happening, man. Just like during team of the year, upgrade packs aren't paying out for me. It's only like League SBC packs that are the ones that pay out for me. If they even do ever even even pay out even 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 even. All right, what did they put in here? Dead, man. These are all so dead. All righty. It's time for the Prem Guaranteed Pack, boys. Let's do it. Here we go. Seventy chem is gonna piss me off, man. Um, what are we saying, boys? What are we saying? Is it gonna be a W pack pull or gonna be a big L? So Rui Costa can piss off. What other what other players am I okay to get rid of? Uh, yeah, okay, so. Rui Costa can go. See you later. I was tempted to get rid of uh, Luis Figo, but I, he's kind of he's kind of beastly, actually. Um, I kind of need all of these guys. Ter Stegen can go. Ter 
Tempted to get rid of Felipe Coutinho. Felipe Coutinho. I'm thinking Conte can go eventually, too. Uh, I just don't, do not use Conte anymore for anything. He would still get into our French setup. I don't know. Eh, I'll throw Conte in there for now. He might not go. Hierro can go. Busquets can go, too, of course. Sergio Ramos can go. All of these guys can go. No problems there. I do want to try and get rid of um, as many... They, okay, what I'm doing here and how I'm doing it, dudes, might be very weird to you guys. And I do apologize. It might be... Um, like, it might not be... It might not make sense if that... If that makes sense. But there is a rhyme or reason. I think I'm going to get rid of Campbell, too. Not going to get rid of Maguire yet. Might save him. Tony, I was thinking maybe we could get rid of. I don't know if I have a better striker than him for England. So, we said Swift we were going to get rid of, guys? Or do we go even lower rated for the time being and get that, like, goalkeeper gone? You gone... Um, Jacobson can go. Kind of want to keep cash. I like cash. For these guys. I don't think, like, anything above... Or, sorry, below... Whiteman can fuck right off, actually. Yeah, that Matty Cash I don't really want to get rid of. Palmer. Okay. Now, I'm also going to throw in... You guys are going to have to help me, help remind me which ones are specifically the Sudamerica players. For the life of me, I can't remember which ones are Sud versus um, non-Sud. So, is this from the Libertadores grind or the Sudamerica grind? Bustos is Sudamerica for sure, right? I think it's... Okay, so he's Lib. All right, roger that. So, I've got all three. So, Bustos for sure. Is it... Cardo Cardozo and Perea? Dominguez is Sud? Are, okay, so these three bros... Yeah? Okay. All right. So, of course, we get the uh, the rating. Still get the rating. Um, still get the rating. Still get the rating. Okay, so that... Just that one drops the rating. Okay. Um. Okay. Now. Um, wait. Oh, they're from Sud, but they're they're still not from the same league. Okay, Roger that. Uh, da, 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 da. Okay, so that gets us a few links. Hmm. Dominguez and oh yeah, ball. 
Dominguez instead of Bustos. Okay, thank you. Oh, also. And then can make him a left wing. Wait, if I make him a left wing, do we get it? If I make him a left wing, I think we get it. No? It's close. Yeah, yeah, okay, so it's close. Tristegan in goal doesn't actually help us, oddly enough. Try to get a center forward too. Yep. Or CDM to center mid. I guess whichever one we have untradeable. All right, what are we saying? Could we be doing anything better here? I don't think so. Soul Campbell's never going to get used. Um, he really isn't. I mean, I'm not against putting him in here, but we lose so much chemistry. So, so, so much chemistry goes. Hey, baby! Oh my god, Tabule! So good. Look at this! For lunch? We're recording. Steph knows we're recording. Coming across yeah, like the no, best I wife am. ever. Look at that. I Chicken? Am. You are the best wife ever. No, 100% best wife ever. Thank you, baby. Love you. Chicken? Zatar? Woo! Well, not Zatar, actually. That is absolutely not Zatar. Tzatziki, hummus, and tabule, boys. Living the dream. I can't wait, bro. Hero for Campbell? Hero for Campbell? I mean, it's even higher rated, though. No, no, no. That drops. Um. You know what? Let's just do it, boys. Let's just fail. You know what? Who cares? It's not that deep. We'll grind the suit America another two, three times today. Get the players back. We're chilling. We're all good. It's fine. So, unfortunately, I actually need two more. Huh. I'm going to have to do... I'm going to have to make both changes. Why the hell does that work? I have no idea why that works, guys. All right. There it is. Done deal. I know Kante is going, but it's all right. He, he, Kante has not even featured in any games for me in about two months. Now that we've got team of the season in DD and all of these, all these awesome players, man. All right, there we go. Twitter needs to know too, bros. Twitter needs to know too. Seven. You have 30 seconds. Guaranteed DL team of the season pack. Okay. Go. All right, bros. Come on. Shamo. Let it be good. Please no Dean Henderson. I don't even know. I couldn't even tell you who I would want. Let's go have a quick little gander at the Premier League team and see if there realistically is something that's going to help us out here. Like, what would be... Where the hell? Oh, here we go. What would be the biggest help for this entire team? I mean, a Hyungmin Son would be nutty, right? An Aubameyang would be nutty. A De Bruyne would also go into the Dream Team, which would be nuts. A duplicate Virgil van Dijk or a duplicate Soyonsu is honestly the two I'm least happy with or a, du or, or a Dean Henderson. Those are like the three I hope to not get. And I feel like I'm probably going to get one of those guys. So, let's get it, dudes. Thank you so much for all watching the episode. I appreciate the continued support. Tomorrow, even if this is garbage, tomorrow's a big day, dudes. Two guaranteed red Premier League team of the seasons from our um, Foot Champs rewards. All of the rewards. We'll craft even more packs as well for tomorrow, or however many more we can craft. Um, 
And for the first time in a while, considering how good our opened mid-icon pack was yesterday, we're just going to open this Premier League pack to finish things off. So I love you guys. God bless. Smash the like button if you made it all the way to the end here. If you're watching this live on stream, click the follow button. Get your team of the season in the uh, comments or in the, in, the, in the chat as well. You get one entry times three giveaways if you're a non-sub. You get five entries times three giveaways if you're a subscriber as well, right? $700 right now. Um, if we get a top Premier League player, it'll be another $100 added into the giveaway. So come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Here we go. Without further ado, come on, young men, baby. Please. Oh, it's going to be Henderson. It's going to be Henderson. No, please. Oh, God. Please write back. Yes, I don't care. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. It wasn't freaking Henderson. I'll take it. Of course the Leeds United fan gets freaking Juan Bissaka, dude. Of course a Leeds United fan gets Juan Bissaka. Looks better in a Leeds kit than he does in a Man United kit. I'll fight you. We'll test him out this weekend, dudes. He was really good at the start of the year. Um... I would have been happier with a Trent Alexander-Arnold for the way I play the game, but we'll test him out. He, f he slots right into two positives here. He slots right into our dream team for now. Um, and he actually starts on our Premier League team. So for me, it could have been worse. I understand that a lot of people are going to get some crazy pack pulls, but knowing my luck this week, it was very, very expected that I was going to get a Henderson or a duplicate Soyonsu. So I consider that a win. Thank you guys so much. Uh, as always, we'll catch you videos on the flip side. Peace.